Hey guys, we're back with another video. You guys know what it means when I'm sitting at my table that we're going to do another declutter, okay? I have went ahead and taken out my blushes. Now, I don't have that many blushes, okay? I don't have that many blushes, but we're gonna still try to get this down to a little bit less. It's just too much, more than any one person can use, and so I'm gonna go ahead and get these out of my collection. Before we get started, don't forget to go ahead and subscribe, like, thumbs up this video if you enjoy my declutters, and don't forget to click that notification bell, okay? Okay. <laughs> Pardon the interruption, but if you're interested in purchasing any of my declutter products, make sure you email me for pricing and availability. It goes very fast, so check it out. See the description box for details. Back to the video. So jumping right into this, we have 48 blushes sitting here right in front of me. 48 blushes. I plan to declutter this hopefully down in the 20s. That is what I'm hoping. Those are all the blushes that I need because I also have blush palettes as well. So I don't really use single blushes as much as I would like. So I'm trying to get these down to the 20s. So help me out. Let's not waste any more time. Let's jump right in. I know for a fact I am keeping this MAC Simpsons blush. This I don't even use. I've used it like once, but I don't take it out of the packaging. This is like a collector's item. It's so, so pretty. I have it upside down there. It's so, so pretty though. Like how can you get rid of that? So I'm not going to get rid of this one. Um, it's actually a really pretty blush color too, but I just keep it for the packaging and I'm keeping it in the box and I'm not going to let it go. A few more that I know I'm keeping. This one is the Natasha Denona blush. This one's in Tao Tao. I think that's what it's called. Tao Tao and matte nude so that's the way it looks this blush is really really pretty so I'm definitely keeping it along with my three NARS blushes right here I have luster I have orgasm and then I also have sin I want to keep all three of those those are just absolutely beautiful so something that I know I can get rid of is this Essence blush. This is the Satin Touch blush. I just never reach for this blush, so I'm going to go ahead and let that go. Along with this Urban Decay blush, this is in the shade Rapture. Really don't use it. Don't really need it. Oh, it's really pretty, though. Ooh. Do I have something like this? I don't know. Okay, I'm on the fence about this one. I want to keep this e.l.f. blush because I plan to do a full face of e.l.f. very, very soon for you guys. So I'm going to keep that. But I am going to get rid of these two NYX blushes. These have to be like six years old. They're so old, but these were such good blushes. So I love them, but I got to get rid of them. I'm also going to let go of this loose blush here. This is the Luminous Loose Blush by Studio Makeup. I think I got this in a boxy charm. I'm never going to use this. I don't use loose blushes. I haven't even opened this, so I'm going to let that go. I'm also going to let go of these two ColourPop blushes. Just don't use them. The formula on these are amazing, but they're just colors that I would not normally use. And sorry about the light glare, you guys. I'm trying to fix that. But <laughs> these are blushes that I would not normally use, so I'm going to let them go. I have two Milani blushes right here. I am going to keep this one in Berry Amore. I am going to let this one go in Red Vino. I will never, ever use this shade. I know that for a fact. So I think I feel comfortable letting it go. Along with this NYX Whipped. What is this? This is a whipped, I think it's a lip and cheek color. Not going to use this, so we're going to go ahead and get rid of that. This is going to be a really short video, you guys, because we're going to do this here. I'm going to let go of both of these Kylie blushes, not using them at all. This one is in the shade X-Rated, and this one is in the shade Virginity. I'm going to let both of those go. I'm also going to let go of this Black Radiance blush. This one's in Plum Sorbet. I used to love this blush, but I just don't reach for it anymore. But it's a really good drugstore option if you're looking for one. So, um, yeah, if you're looking for one, check it out. But I just don't reach for it. I think we're doing really, really good, you guys. Really good. I'm definitely keeping all of my MAC blushes except for Pink Swoon. This was my first high-end blush, you guys. This was my first MAC blush, my first high-end blush, and it's really hard for me to get rid of this, but I'm not gonna wear a hot pink color like this, so just gonna let it go. But I am gonna keep, what is this in? Make You Mine, this is one of my favorites. I'm gonna keep Love Joy, which is another favorite, and then I'm going to keep Mo, no I'm not. 
This is Mocha. I'm gonna let Mocha go. I totally want to keep these two Wet n Wild blushes. This one's in Mellow Wine and this one's in Heather Silk. But I am going to get rid of this one. This is actually a newer one that I got that I never even opened called Don't Flutter Yourself. I'm never going to use this, so we're going to let it go. We're just down to these right here. Um, Laura Geller, totally keeping. I use this. I use this a lot. I actually really, really love this blush, so I'm keeping that. Um, this is the Blush and Brighten in Apricot Berry. This one here is a Jordana blush in Redwood. I actually really like this one, so I'm going to keep that for a little while longer. I actually just purchased this, but it's more of a blush topper than a blush. This is the Benefit Box Blush in Gold Rush. It's more of a blush topper. I don't really love it, so I'm going to let that go. Definitely keeping the Kat Von D blush in, what was this called? Hardogram? Heartogram, so pretty. I have the Becca blush in Damselfly. Just don't use it very often, so I'm gonna let that go. I'm also gonna let go of these two blushes from LA Girl. One is in, uh, what is this, Just For Fun, and the other one is in Just Love. I'm gonna let those go. They're just way too bright for my taste these days. But from that line, I will be keeping this one in Just Fearless. This one is really, really pretty. I'm just gonna say it now, I'm keeping all of my Tarte Amazonian Clay blushes. I love these and I got rid of so many of these in my last declutter. Don't wanna get rid of any more. These are great like neutral blush shades, like my favorites. So I'm keeping all of these. But I am gonna get rid of both of these LA Color blushes. These are their Red Rouge, Rad Rouge blushes. One in like Totally and the other one in Psych. I have two City Color blushes right here. I'm going to get rid of both of these. I'm just not using them. They are in Fresh Melon and Guava. Just not going to use them, so I'm going to let them go. Last blushes, you guys. Last few. I have one from Coastal Scents. This is a super deep pigmented blush that I just don't reach for very often. It is so pigmented, though. But I think I'm going to go ahead and let it go. This is a new blush that I haven't even opened. This is from the Collab makeup brand and it's in the shade Soft Spot. I think I'm gonna keep this one. I just wanna give it a try and see how it works. So my last three blushes are Lorac, what are these called? Infrared, Infrarouge blushes, I think they're called. And this is how they all look. I don't know you guys, I haven't made a decision yet. I look like I have something like this, so I can let this one go. I'm gonna let all three of them go. Don't need them. All right, you guys, so here are all of the blushes that I am getting rid of. I counted them all up and I counted 27 blushes. So of the 48 that I had, I'm getting rid of 27. 48 minus 27 equals 21 blushes. I got rid of over half of my makeup collection. So I am so proud of myself, you guys. I'm so happy to get rid of the stuff that I am just not using, not loving. So let's see what we got rid of here, okay? We got rid of, I went ahead and decluttered this Urban Decay blush. We have some Lorac blushes, Coastal Scents, Kylie Cosmetics, City Color, LA Girl, Studio Makeup. We have two sets of NYX blushes right here. ColourPop, LA Colors, Essence, Black Radiance, Wet n Wild, MAC, Benefit, Becca, and Milani. 27 blushes out of the whole entire bunch. That makes me so, so happy. Thank you guys so much for watching this video. I hope you guys are enjoying my declutter series thus far. Give this video a thumbs up and let me know down below what you want me to declutter next. I'm leaning towards bronzers. I'm leaning towards face powders. I don't know, one or the other. Let me know what part of my makeup you want me to declutter next. And I think I'll talk to you guys in the next video. I love you so, so much. Subscribe to my vlog channel, always linked down below. And I'll talk to you later. Bye.